because you guys the part two. I want I know some of them you see why I did I had to do this due to what's going on in Boston. There's no other all the department. All the department. All the departments in Boston try to cover, none of them are covered. Due to corruption, violence, and union problems. Crisis going on. And which was an education problem. And which was. So the crisis in Boston is over. So that's one of the reasons I have to let you guys see what's going on. Let you guys experience it yourself, see it yourself, hear with yourself. As I am, I have been. So we know whatever lie they make, so we know I'm not lying, I'm not accusing anyone. There's a fact, evidence. If you have to some of them are confidential, I will not let you guys give it to unless you inquire and by email or is it paper by fax or anything like that. But besides anything public thing, so let me show you. You see camera? This camera right there. Camera. You have a camera over there. You have a camera right there. Camera right there. Camera right there. Three cameras right here. And we have a camera in that corner also. And we have a camera over there. That's money for the whole place. So, that's why a lot of times they pull, some of them complain, I'm going to lose your job, I'm the devil. I say, no, I don't make you lose your job. You make yourself lose your job. By stupid, you do something wrong, you lose your job. If you didn't do something stupid, doing something wrong, you're not supposed to, you, you're not. The job is, they give you a policy in law to follow. You're not above the law, you're not a guard, you're doing a job. Especially getting paid by taxpayers. Don't take in person, don't support criminals, don't protect them. You know the rules. It's your job to do your job. You shall yet, by shall get to do so. You will let no choice. But right, you resign, or if I ever in you, or file a choice, or just you, or so even arrest you and present you. And present you. Because it's your responsibility to do the thing right without discrimination. Without lying, without dishonest, because you don't own it. Maybe you just want a job like I am, like politics, like the president doing what he wants. So they will fight. It's not personal. So that's why a lot of times they tell me it's private. The reason they tell me it's private, that's when they come to the place of which you will be. That's it. So a lot of times they bring things to the company. So. I let them know that a lot of time. So I try to be fair with them, give them multi warning and try to be fair with them. And give them chance also, chances to see if they can change. So watch him. That's the ISIS member also. Watch his behavior. If they want a criminal, so watch his behavior. All the members are criminal, you will see the behavior. So, so that's how the crisis is So I need the equipment as soon as possible. And those are criminals involved in forging still money and mining. Remember, 
I let you guys know. And he permitted me to wash my back in the street when I asked him about my fear and gain. Because I do to what they were doing since in Houston. And he busted me to wash my back. So this is, uh, they wash my back in the street just by those junk. So those unemployment workers, police workers, were fired by a lot of them are big blood. They call themselves big blood. Because it's called a family. That's why when they call me blood, they call me boy. I say, don't call me blood, I'm not your blood. Those are the reasons. Okay? So that the one love, la familia, the lion group, all those cowboy hunters. So they all and it's like that. As I tell them, don't I'm not your family, don't call me family. I'm not your family and they call me blood. So All those always the problem. They can't learn, they can't listen. I have no choice. Some of them have to be deported. And I'm in business for 2021. This is your thing here. And the in a cover, right? and I put in the plastic paper. So, it was the suit measure and I promised we made for 2021 to reduce violent theories, violent domestic violent communities. And it's the whole tolerance. As you can see, especially and launching out your gang criminals. Yes. So it's zero tolerance. So, so. We did a good job and thank you for the army and the different department and United States. We did, did a good job. And although LI in Middle East with those axes and she had. So now we have to which is France have to do the part, British have to do the part, South American have to do like Hindi doing the part right now. And launching after those criminal domestic criminals. We want to cause terror. A bunch of workers came in, don't work, don't do nothing. We want to get whatever they want, smoking on them, do violence and do whatever they want. To get away. That's not going to be tolerable. That's not gonna be not on my watch. It's the hotel one's palace. Okay. So let them know I'm not here. I'm not here to make any criminal happy. I'm not making terrorists happy. I'm not here to make any terrorists happy, any criminal happy, any robbery happy, anything not happy. I'm not for that. Don't think they're gonna get that. If no one did that, they're gonna get that from me. They're gonna be safe. So it's gonna be a change. Let's see how the price is gonna be. It's gonna be change and control everything. But those dangerous criminals, group of criminals. So we feel in control. Okay. Well, like I said, where the Guantala Mobe, if the Guantala Mobe will be a good place for a lot of them. Since Boston, whether the mayor keep complaining, whatever they could complain, Guantala Mobe be a best place. Since we can keep them in jail, right? We have nothing to do. They ain't gonna do nothing. They ain't gonna work. They are cause more problems. So away from them, Gontala Mobe, a lot of them, Gontala Mobe, the best way to keep them and where some MP military could yell at the people and teach them how. So, so uh, Gontala Mobe would be the best way to keep a lot of them. So 
that will be keep them there with this a lot of violence, a lot of crime. But these are worthless criminals. They got nothing to lose, got nothing to live for. All they do, all they do, violent, drug, crack, crime, forgery against the deaf, shoplifting. They don't work, they don't do drugs, they don't have education. They don't even care about themselves. Okay. It's option to keep them, but put them in jail, they're going to tell you they don't care, go back to jail. And we all know they will do everything to go back to jail, they never know. The best option is one calamity for a lot of people. So there, once some of them know they're gonna go and go and tell them what they know. Once they can't control, they can't behave. So the West will be controlled because when they know they're gonna go and tell them what they the military is not gonna play with them. So, and some of them that's the defense is to keep them. They're gonna tell them what they know. That would be the best option. Those are put really tired of them, put tired of them. And it seems like police are really tired of the lot of them. Inshallah, I don't think the military will really tired of them. And here. So, we will do a good job. Make sure, please, for the one and his next coach trial, his next coach trial, if he could plead, I mean, if he could accept the deal to give all who was involved for some matter. What's plain be here, who was involved in all of this. So that will be good. That will be good. Because there's some documents I have, and if you guys want them, I will give it to you guys. Some of them are confidential. Let me send to email. You will not see them on, on YouTube in the web. So some of them, like this thing like that, don't be on YouTube. Think what's what now going now, don't be on YouTube. So you guys could pick it up. I have some more of this in my video. So you guys could pick them up and see them. So, what they will reduce the problem, reduce the crisis. Please don't blame it. I don't want to blame it on coronavirus. But, but they do cause problems. The reason I'm protecting this. And this is a, to reduce the problem of coronavirus. This is a transportation. We we'll go to many different. We see Washington, other state. We we'll go to Washington. That's go to New York. That goes to Washington D.C. That go to Florida, California. So they in track. So DOT, let me show you. That's my bed. Masha said DOT. In Marshall said Department of Transportation. So you find the community well and the, the M track also. So you could get the M track here. Attention all passengers. Although the coronavirus all passengers go to the age of two to wear a face covering on traveling on transit. Track travel. Track travel. Track travel. Track travel. Track travel. Track travel. So that's the different states. So a lot of them don't work with masks here. They don't work with masks. And they don't tell them to wear masks. They don't do anything about it. They smoke here. And then, you know the COVID-19. Those are people on the street who do anything stupid. Who don't care about the life. Now. Those are all, a lot about them in charge. Like autism and them in charge. Like you just said. A lot of more autism and them in charge. Homosexual, what is it? Homosexual, them in charge. So, they don't want to mask, they refuse to wear a mask. And they smoke in here. You know, COVID-19 into your room. Smoke to go to your room. 
So whatever comes from to your alarm and some of them get their COVID-19, but they don't get affected by it. So that COVID-19 they smoke in here, we have good no, and it's very freezing and here, no heat. As you can see, everything here is concrete. That's what people sit down and passengers sit down now. So it's very freezing in here. And you can see everything is concrete and metal. So, we just gonna keep the COVID-19 worse while that has been happening. Wash it through. And so wishes that's gonna amplify the COVID-19 here. Amplify the COVID-19. So any passenger who passes, don't worry, master, forget one of those eating or something, breathe that COVID-19 and take the train, go with it, and then spread that COVID-19 with what they know to other state or the city. So what happened? COVID-19 is still gone, still dead, still gone. It's a problem. If the person might be dead, don't know where they get the COVID-19. And you could see, and those are autism, and dementia, LGBT are the worst problem in those. They have no respect for people, they are all gay. Autism, homosexual, they are the most worst problem. So, those are autism on dementia, Alzheimer, or whatever, like Down syndrome, and something like that. They are like a mental problem, and like how they can do it. They are the worst problem. And they never learn, they never listen. And every day, most of the time, you have to go after them for the same thing. And they get violent. So, in that case, that's people who do the COVID 19. People who do the COVID 19. People who do the COVID 19. So, which is the safety violation, health violation. So there's no heat. I always call DOT, the director I spoke with her. She make me call. Uh, let me show you who she told me to call. She gave me her number, the number. I call them. They take them. Say they tell me they're gonna fix it, but they already my mom last did not do anything. This is why they. So I call the director for Mazda, and. She gave me their number, I contact them, they tell me they're gonna fix it, but they haven't fixed it. So the heat in there is not working. There used to be heat, they're not working, central heat. So as people still in that country, I've been seeing a lot of passengers shaking. When I ask them, Are you cold? Yes, I'm cold. I'm feeling shaking and seizing. And then you have those that with no mass and smoking here. What kind of crisis? Is uh, that's the criminal mind. So they haven't do nothing about it. There's no heat. It's something used. The concrete, even my shoes right here, see I'm in the boots. My feet are still cold, killing the coat. So everything is concrete and metal. They should reproduce the cold heat, the cold heat. Anywhere they have the heat, the bathroom is here. A lot of them sleeping in the back. Mm -hmm. So there was the, the heat supposed to be there. They were not. So, the crisis, okay? Mm -hmm. So, is something to protect the people, protect the passenger, protect all their lives, protect the country. And this is a bus station trying to go different states, different states. And to reduce, you need to get rid of the COVID-19 as possible. So, I guess it's addressing to a T uh, TSA director and then the COVID-19 director, the CDC director. Defense director, we need there's something we need to do with the bus station 
transportation in Boston and Massachusetts complete. Because they're not doing the job. They don't care about people's safety and health. They are just careless, especially when it's Caucasian and member of those criminals, dirty criminals, member of a homosexual member of this group. They just don't care. They don't do the job. You know, let them do whatever they want. And this is something need to be made. So this is a very toxic match. I've been with them a long time about. They even to try to retaliate against me and discriminate me for that. So this is something need to be done. It's very with the COVID-19. So no, to be done about. So this is the time so they fall the most, okay? And those guys are like they own the country. Those guys they don't want to tell what to do. They have no respect for no one anywhere they are. And they write. Especially those are homosexual. It's a lot of crisis in Boston. So that's one of the reasons I need the backup. I need the equipment, the grant for the equipment, and I need the backup. And I got robbery with some employer from an employment for PUA and the money now. And, and the most important that we have is the African American, and Haitian, and Northern. And take the money to give those criminals you send if you don't criminal, if you do not. And we tell them, go get a job, leave me alone. Okay, I'll go back to school, leave me alone. So, that's why I want the African American to so stay away from me. It has to be the only marshal in Boston. Besides, I am a person who is educated and better. Because they are highly dangerous in the country. So, we stay away. Anything belong to me, have to do to me, we stay away. The Haitian also are telling them that. Like, the Jamaican, the same thing, I tell them that. I tell them that they spy. Stay away from me. So, anything have to do with me, stay away. Don't get involved. Don't care, they may tell what to do, they make choice for me, don't think. That is something they can't. They learn a lesson. So it could be dangerously negative. So they can't even defend themselves, stand up for themselves. That's the reason. So, it's the crisis here in Boston. Okay? Need to be fixed, need to be resolved. So, thank you. There will be more to come. And I want you guys to see it. Be my witnessing. I heard the Spanish talking. And they were more worse and more things. You gotta be shocking. And to see and to hear. So what is going on in the middle of the United States? So to see what I'm going through every day. It's like I'm over so much and over a thousand, thousand million toddlers. crisis. And they're the one who try to find me. I'm the crazy one. I'm the one who don't know what I'm doing. I'm the one who need help. I'm the one who watches them. They are not. As you can see. And they're way more worse than because we'll see what it is. So, the crisis. To be fixed. Another thing, when they have those junkie homosexuals, criminals, they could call any shelter worker and say they have, you have involved in sex, they have to pay, uh, they pay them on your, even though they don't want you to call them faggot. That's how you guys keep using the word faggot. Homosexual anything. They don't want to say that to them, but they will co claim money and harvest and you guys see it. 
You don't listen to that. This is the reason my governor, Congressman McGovern, said this is the reason or the reason I 